There's someone in there, right? Why don't you take a seat? Oh, man. Uh -huh. Welcome to the confessional. It seems a new lamb has appeared. Who are you? This is the world of nightmares. You are the lambs who have been chosen. You'll all be dead soon. What? Don't be ridiculous. But before I kill you, I want to determine your life's worth. So, I'll have you answer my question. Damn it, what is this? Question one. Is marriage the point where life begins or ends? Pull the rope with the answer that best matches your true feelings. <laughs> So that's your choice. That's surprising. Hey, who are you? Are you doing all this? No. I merely watch over the sheep. Someone else dropped you here. Someone in the real world wanted you to be dropped here and wanted you to die. It's someone you know. <sighs> if you want the truth, you'll have to survive. But since you seek survival, I will take you to the next trial. What is going on? There's still more? Commencing area two. Are you ready? <laughs> All right, I got it. Are you getting the hang of this? How the fuck am I supposed to get the hang of this? Hey, don't run off ahead, help me! Sorry, man, but I'm not going to die helping you. I've got to climb too. Oh yeah, as you climb, you'll run into strange items. Strange items? You can pick up items by touching them. Remember, you can only hold one at a time. Press X to use it. You probably can't hold many, but you should hang on to one, just in case. I'll take this. Yeah! How's this? Right. Hey, about those coins. Yeah, what are these? I don't really know, but the amount you get depends on how fast you climb. If you're looking to collect a lot of them, keep that in mind. Your score is measured in Enigma coins. As you climb up each new step, more coins will be added to your score. Use these coins to purchase items on the landings between stages. Your score is also used as a condition for unlocking additional game features. The faster you climb, the more bonus coins you will earn. If you want more coins, Climb faster and aim for a high score. All right, I got it. Edge, edge. If you're crushed by a falling block, you're dead. Are you serious? Give me a break! If you are crushed by a block, the game will end. Watch out for wobbling blocks. Uh, all right. Uh. Ugh. <sighs> 
Ouch. <laughs> All right, I got it. Good. I'll take this. Fudge. It's gonna start getting fierce. You mean the other guys climbing with me? They're in my way! They're all trying to climb, like you. This is a dog-eat-dog -dog world. There's no time for courtesy. Anyway, no matter what pops up, stay calm and keep climbing. Two creatures cannot stand on a block at the same time. Sometimes, sheep will get in your way as they try and climb to the top. To move a sheep out of your way, move up against him and shove him. Right, I got it. Right, I got it.
wish I did. The map on the left side of the screen shows you how far you are from the goal. Stages vary in length, so be mindful of your progress. All right, I got it. Huh? Fudge! All right, I got it. All right, I got it. survived. Impressive. It's you. Looks like you're still alive. Is that you? You're safe too. Barely. Still. How many people died trying to come here? People? I don't... Listen. Here. You see everybody else as sheep, but all these sheep, they're really human. There's got to be some reason why we were all brought here. What reason could there be? Why do we have to suffer like this? Who knows? But I do have an idea. An idea? Let's stop the speculation. It's just going to confuse us more. <sighs> you should think of what to do next. I'm hearing rumors of something big coming soon. You be careful now. Something big. Still, you're really getting the hang of things. There's nothing more I can teach you. That can't be true. Come on, you gotta have something you can tell me. If we're lucky, we'll meet again. Uh, hey, wait! Uh, right. While on landings, you can learn techniques to help you climb higher. Crawling around blindly won't help you escape. There is valuable information to be found, and you can only find it here. Oh, you're new here, am I right? Let me ask, do you have any coins? You may have seen them lying around while you're climbing. I'll trade you useful items for them. Huh. Would you rather have coins than an item? I'm a numismatist. I love money. There's nothing in life money can't buy. I've got a plaque with that on it in my office. No matter what world you're in, as long as you've got money, you can do anything. These gold coins are symbols, symbolizing money. And if that's the case, then I can save myself if I have enough of it. That's my theory, anyway. Oh, so you don't know... If you are still having trouble getting through a stage, if you are already carrying an item, it will be replaced. However, buying items makes it more difficult to earn the gold prize. If you want an item, pony up some coins. Tonight's product is... The white cube creates a block in front of you. Nah, I don't need it. Huh? You think your window... Uh, uh... Excuse me. Please come again. I found this out just now. Yo, have we met before? You survived because of the techniques I found, huh? Tell me something. Let me show you another great technique, man. Allow me to explain suspending. This technique gives you more room to maneuver. Push a block off a ledge with nothing below it. As long as the edges connect, the block will remain in place. How's that? I'm a regular blockologist, huh? Hmm, that's a good start. Allow me to explain pullback. If you climb up and find yourself stuck, try pulling a block and backing down. By creating a stairway as you go down, you will be able to go higher than you could before. That's crazy. You knew that? Yeah, I knew. Anyway, what I'm getting at is, this kind of stuff has to become second nature to you. I know. I can't just rely on my natural reporter's instinct. It's the truth. Just techniques, huh? Okay, you find any new moves, you come straight to me. This is coming from the executive manager. It, it's that sheep again. I gotta play dead. I'm not a sheep. All the sheep here are really human. Really? What? Really? I, I just pushed two sheep a little while ago. 
I saw a sheep fall past me on my way up. I, I can't get that scream out of my head. It won't go away. All you'll hear is your own death scream. You can stay here. Even this place will fall eventually. What's with all the cubes? I don't understand any of this. What should I do? Please help me. You just gotta climb. Learn some techniques to get higher. Techniques? Like what? Maybe this will... Allow me to explain the tornado. If blocks are stacked all over the place, calm down and pull them out one by one. Move them aside and bring them down like a tornado. Then make a staircase and climb. Whoa, is that how you climb? Wow, you're amazing. <laughs> Monster! It's fuzzy and fluffy at the same time, and it's coming right at me! <laughs> Snap out of it. There's nothing like that anywhere near here. The talks. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Huh? Hey, didn't you shove me just a few minutes ago? How dare you? You're just some sheep. I'll shove you next time. I heard that all the sheep here are actually people. News flash. Fuck you. I need to make sure I survive. That's horrible. Yeah, what good is having pity going to do you in here? No matter what happens to anyone else, I'm gonna live. Hey, are you the same as me? Were you put down here by some trick? Why were we chosen? Do you know anything? Come on! How can I survive? I can't keep climbing! I don't know anything either. Listen, you want to live and climb. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Hey. I told you. Oh, man. You're here, Lost Lamb. He'll be answering another of my questions. Right, I've had enough of this. A man's worth can't be measured by a single question. This is the second question. Do you feel more anxious when you're alone or when among many people? <laughs> You've made your selection. I knew it! I'll answer your question this time, little lost lamb. This entire place is an immense sanctuary. There are eight floors. This is the second night, and only the second floor. Wait, does that mean there's an end to this? If I can get to the end, I don't have to die? Don't get your hopes up. You'll never be able to reach the pinnacle. Anyway, listen. I hear the sounds of your night terrors approaching. <laughs> Are you ready? I don't like that laugh. So what the hell's going on here? You won't escape. Huh? What? That voice. Where have I? I won't let you escape. What the fuck is this? Catherine? The fists of grudge have appeared. It's the king. Do not Ed. die.
Gone? I'm saved, right? Yeah! Congratulations! Amazing climbing! The prison of despair could not hold you. just a tradition, right? Seriously, who wants to be tied down? As long as two people are together, it's okay, right? It's supposed to be free, don't you think? Kind of surprising. Hmm? You know how it is with most girls. As soon as they're adults, all they can think about is tying the knot, right? But there are girls like you out there. <laughs> Never knew. Oh, it's not that strange, is it? Men aren't the only ones who fear being chained down. I'll remember that. Goodness, huh? we think alike. Oh! tomorrow so I need to get home oh, oh. I had fun tonight oh, oh. you must like what you see I'm not staring you're a bad liar you taste like smoke <laughs> but I don't mind <laughs> you don't say Just met. 
Jeez, what the hell am I saying? Hmm. Huh? Um, is this going to be a problem? So, okay, I cheated on Catherine. This is bad. This is really, really bad. But I didn't make a move. She forced herself on me. Oh, fuck, man. I drank way too much. Ha <laughs> Uh, would you mind not staring at me like that? It's kind of creepy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Listen, I don't want you to get the wrong idea, okay? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. Huh? Oh. Oh. So, how do you feel about me? Huh? Oh. Wow. Um, I can't quite explain it. Uh, I feel odd. Hmm? Huh? You see, this is my first time. Oh, wow. I can't believe it. And I am really screwing this up right now. So then, it was love at first sight? Huh? Ah! What? I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess? Sorry. I, uh, I gotta go now. I have a, um, a dentist appointment now. Dentist? Yeah. Dentists get angry if you're late, too. Oh, I wanted to stay with you a little longer. I guess they'll have to wait until next time. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Hey, wait. I'm actually dating somebody. <sighs> this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. Ah, you know what? It just hit me. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. Hot streaks? Well, when the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. Oh, crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have. I'm not like you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I gonna do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Uh, if you're gonna whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. Well, no shit. I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> Well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pick. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <laughs> I am so fucked. Hey, have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on, if you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, uh, you all right, man? You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Anyway, you're way too freaked out over a one-night stand. Hey, you paying attention? Listen, man. Huh. I never saw the girl. Oh, really? I figured one of you guys told her to sit with me. Eh, uh, if this girl was cute, you'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say, 
Because of you, Derek, I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies' man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah, I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, and has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? Hmm. So, did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Whoa, Erica. Okay, enough of that. So have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They say it targets cheating men and kills them. Or not. Which is it? Wait, 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 what? What exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. Who are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. My eye... Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I, I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. Let's just leave me alone. Well, well, come on, tell me about this girl. Oh, God. Apparently, she's destiny level cute. Cut that shit out. Are you kidding? Finding your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. You're in trouble, right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha ha ha, shut up. I'm done fooling around. Press the B button to get up from your seat and walk around the bar. If you press start to open the menu, you can see hints on how to spend your time at the bar. You can change the difficulty of the nightmare stages from the config screen. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? Oh, uh, sorry for staring. <laughs> Please sit. Ever heard this story before? The man who climbs the highest mountain gets his every wish granted. What's that? It said a man climbed that mountain 300 years ago and was given a fortune. It said a man climbed that mountain 700 years ago and was given the world. A man who climbs the mountain now will be given his future to do with as he pleases. Is this a fairy tale or something? These are true stories. The story of Rapunzel is based on this true story. A prince who was able to climb a very tall tower gained his princess. Now, what will you gain? Huh? Will you become the man of legends? 